Hi everyone, it's B here. Today I will be making husband and wife cake or called bánh phu thê. Here are the ingredients. Mung bean wash and soak overnight. Blade in the steamer, make an empty space in the middle, wrap the lid with kitchen towel to prevent the water drop into the mung bean. Steam for 15 minutes. After 15 minutes, let the mung bean cool down. Then place in the food processor as sugar, cooking oil, and salt. Blend it well until it becomes a paste like this. Scoop one teaspoon, play into your palm, and grow it into small balls. Roll the sesame seed until it lightly golden there. In a microwave bowl, add two cup of tapioca flour, two cup of water, or bandan leaf extract. Add two tablespoons of coconut flour, two tablespoons of sugar. Stir well until it dissolves. microwave for 90 seconds. After 90 seconds, the edge of the flour is cooked in the middle, still liquid. Stir well together. Then place in the microwave for another 40 seconds. Now only halfway cooked. Combine well together until it becomes elastic like this. Grease the spoon and a small cup to prevent it sticking. Scoop a little bit of the dough blade on the small bowl. Flat it down. Blade the mung bean ball in the middle. Breast it down a little bit. Scoop a little bit of the dough blade on top. Seal the top and the lower layer really well. Lay in the steamer. Let steam for 10 to 15 minutes or until it transfusion. Wrap the lid with the kitchen towel. After 10 to 15 minutes, the cake is cooked. Remove from the steamer and let it cool completely before wrapping. Place the food wrap on the plate. Remove the cake. Then place the cake on the food wrap. Wrap it up like this. Optional. Sprinkle some sesame seed on the food wrap. Then lay the cake on top. This cake is so yummy and easy to make. If you get bored of one color, you can make any other color that you like. Finished product should look like this. Isn't it pretty? Thanks for watching everyone. If you like this recipe, don't forget to give me a thumb up and subscribe to my channel. And I will see you in my next video. Bye for now.